So this is a kindness to the body practice, and you can do this seated or lying down. Really an opportunity to work with and care for your own body. So settling into a comfortable position, making adjustments to your posture, and letting your attention settle on the breath for a few moments. And this practice is in three parts, and you can do any or all of the parts. So just do what's right for you. In the first part, you're invited to bring to mind parts of the body or functions of the body that you find really easy to appreciate or that you like. In the second part, you're invited to bring to mind parts of the body or functions of the body that you have a more neutral sense of. And in the third part, you're invited to bring to mind parts of the body or functions that you have a more difficult relationship with that you either dislike or you find painful or hard to be with. I'm going to meet each of these with some phrases. So to begin with inviting you to bring to mind parts of your body or functions of the body that you find easy to appreciate, easy to be with, or that you like. And it's not about these parts or functions being perfect or being ideal. It's about your ability to tune into them and appreciate them. And they can be external things like eyes or that you like your hair. Or they can be parts of the body that you don't really see or really even feel. It could be, for example, your spleen or your digestive system. So bringing to mind as many parts of the body as you can that you appreciate You might appreciate your ability to see, for example, and really enjoy being able to see even though your eyesight's not perfect and you need glasses. And out of all of these parts or functions, tuning into the one right now that you find most strong or salient, the easiest one to be with, or the one you have the greatest sense of appreciation for, and giving it your full attention, bringing this, holding this part of the body in your heart and mind, and inviting you to repeat some phrases internally in words that are meaningful for you. So just choosing the phrases that resonate for you and repeating them in your own words, holding this part of the body in mind. May you be safe and protected. May you be healthy and well. May I be a good friend to you. May you get the care and support you need, the nourishment. May you have ease. May I appreciate you and all that you do for me. You might like to bring other parts of the body that you appreciate to mind, making these same kind wishes. May you be safe. May you be healthy and well. May I be a good friend to you. May you get the care and support you need. May you have ease. May I appreciate you. May I appreciate you and all that you do for me. And then gently letting that focus go and bringing to mind parts of the body or functions of the body that you have a more neutral relationship with. Maybe you don't think about them or notice them much, perhaps because they're hidden or they don't hurt. So it might be, for example, your elbows or an internal organ that just seems to do its thing. I'm choosing the one that you would like to practice with, holding it in your heart and mind, and making these same kind intentions, repeating these internally in words that are meaningful for you. May you be safe and protected. May you be as strong and healthy as you can be. May you get the care and support that you need, the nourishment. May I be a good friend to you. May you 
have ease. May I appreciate you and all that you do for me. And then gently letting that focus go when you're ready. And bringing to mind parts of the body or functions of the body that you have some difficulty with. Might be because there's a limitation or a vulnerability, an injury or pain. Or maybe that you don't like the way they look. Or that there's been some difficult history with this part of the body. And inviting you, particularly the first time you practice this, to choose to work with a part that's, the difficulty is the size that you can handle right now. So just checking in around what you're up for and bringing this part, holding it in your heart and mind and repeating these phrases internally in words that are meaningful for you. May you be safe. May you be as strong and healthy as it's possible for you to be. May you get the care and support that you need, the nourishment. May you have ease. May I be a good friend to you. May I appreciate you and all that you do for me. And feel free to stay with this practice as long as you like. Otherwise, gently bringing it to a close. Just reflecting and really tuning in and noticing what's here for you right now, what that was like for you and what it offers you. And coming back.